Good morning, you guys. My head, I'm wearing this hat right now. And I swear, like, it looks cute from the side and from the back. But when I vlog, like, head on, I swear I look like an egg. So, that's what we're dealing with right now. But welcome back to my channel, you guys. My name is Maggie, if you are new here. I'm currently getting ready for school, packing. Um, I need to leave in 12 minutes. And I'm packing to go to the Cape after I get out of class. So, I just have a little mini suitcase. I'm going to put some clothes in it. I have all my toiletries, my shampoo, conditioner, chargers, laptop, everything that I need. It's so funny because I'm going for one night with my sister to stay at my dad's house and I'm bringing a suitcase. I feel like whenever I go places, I hate bringing like bags just because I have a lot of stuff that's heavy like I bring my shampoo my skincare my laptop chargers like it doesn't seem like a lot but it's all the stuff that I need and all of it is really heavy so I feel like I end up having to lug around like this really heavy bag and it's just so much easier if I bring a suitcase because then I can roll it and it's a lot more efficient so I'm going to put this stuff in here right now, but I just want to start off the vlog and say what's up and say good morning. I'm bringing some stuff that me and Emma are going to cook for dinner at my dad's house. I have these tortillas and I think we're going to make um, like a little taco type things tonight. And then I'm bringing some crackers with hummus to have after my class just to pulled me over when I drive to the Cape and then I have a green juice right here. So bringing these things and I'm gonna have these two tangerines before I leave. I just got out of a workout and I had um, yogurt and fruit earlier this morning but I wanna have something else before I go so I'm gonna bring these. Also, I'm bringing these cupcakes with me and they are by the company baked by Melissa and I first had these a few years ago at the airport I was at JFK on a layover and they had like a little store and I remember just getting little bite-sized cupcakes and they were like the perfect size you can get so many different flavors they have so many to choose from and it's so cool because like you don't have to eat the whole cupcake they're just like little miniature ones and I'll show you guys I'm so excited I'm bringing these for me and Emma to have tonight at my dad's but they are the vegan ones so there's all these different flavors on the cards right here and they're so cute and mini I can't wait to try these ones and I got Marcus a box of them for his birthday and he's been so obsessed with them he sends me snapshots every single day of him eating his cupcakes and he loves them so I just think that they're the perfect gift idea for like Valentine's Day I know Valentine's Day is coming up if you guys want to get a little something for your friends your boyfriend your girlfriend um, whoever in your life you want to treat with these little miniature treats I think that they're so cute and they're such a great gift idea and I also got a discount code for you guys you guys can go to bakedbymelissa.com enter the promo code Maggie for 15% off of your whole order they have regular um, cupcakes they have vegan they have so many to choose from so I will leave a link down below in the description so you guys can check it out so I'm really excited to have these me and Emma when we're together we always like to have little treats and I think that these are the cutest I remember we sat here during the summer and I was vlogging we were taking a junior shot and we were just going on salad It's the vegan chopped. Oh, so good. It hurt people because I did that, but I can look at that and not have shame over it. Because I felt like I was like, I felt like doing it, popping pills and smoking a blind and starting my day. You know, so it just got scary. 
I basically said to myself, I'm like, God, if you're real, get me through this season of stopping these pills and stuff. And We're watching the Justin so Bieber documentary. To have gifts and an opportunity to make a change. The sunset was so pretty. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> I was crying for the documentary. Why? Because he said life is worth living? No. You okay? It's not like I'm sad. It's just almost like a relief hearing the other people talk about things like that. And like people that you would think are fine. Yeah. Like Justin. And because sometimes I feel like people see people's life online and they just think that it's perfect all the time. <laughs> We've all, all the way over there is sandwich. Like that tower is where that Mary loses. <laughs> I know. I want you guys to listen outside. We rolled down the window. And just listen. And breathe. She loves a good sunset. She loves a good sky. Just any sort of my sky girl. I really miss living by the water and being by the water in general. It just feels like such a breath of fresh air. I feel like sometimes it's hard to like remember what it used to be like you know like living in a city it's just so busy all the time like you're go 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 but you don't really take a moment to like relax yeah even if you're like, and, like sitting be down, where you are but like, like there's so much like... going on like you look out your window and it's like traffic you fall asleep at night all night all you hear are the cars yeah, it's, it's like there's not like here. silence you know and like i feel like we are so breathe. used to it I know. it's so weird like Thinking back to us growing up here, like that one photo that's my um, screensaver for mm -hmm. my computer. It just like reminds me of us like living here and being like soft. And the water is like so fresh and <sighs> everything like smells good. Just makes you appreciate, you know. cooking up some dinner. Mm -hmm. I just cut up an onion and a yellow pepper and an orange pepper and a yellow onion and sauteing that up. And then we have our tortillas, guacamole, guacamole. salsa, cheese, and some sauerkraut. Oh my god, this pepper is so good. This is my mood when I'm at home on the cake. Salt it. Salt it is clean. My mom and I bought this salt. I know. <laughs> yeah, this actually looks so good. So we did the tortilla cheese, peppers, onions, guac, salsa, sauerkraut, and then um, we have a kale Caesar salad on the side. Can, like hear animals this is so weird this is literally so weird I feel like sometimes like there's just so much going on in the city that I forget about like the sounds of like nature and like the smell I'm gonna smell it Yeah. 
my god, it's so weird. <laughs> it like, smells like when I would go for a run in the morning and then go to work. Mm -hmm. It's so crazy. Good morning, you guys. Obviously, like, go in because in the summer, this place is packed. Emma brought me to Bagels and Beyond this morning for coffee. We got hazelnut iced coffees. It's so good. I really didn't expect it to taste like this. Like, so good. I don't know. It, it kind of reminds me of a mix between like Mary Lou's and Bridgewater Bagel. Wow, I, this actually looks so good. We got bagels, a vegan cream cheese, and then we put avocado and tomato from Joe Mama's. <laughs> Hello everybody, I just got home to my apartment. It is, actually I got home like an hour ago. It's 9.27 p.m. And I am unpacking all my stuff. I didn't really bring that much to the Cape. I just brought um, like clothes to wear today. I have my clothes from yesterday. I'm gonna do some laundry probably. And um, unpack all my stuff, put it away. But I got some stuff today. Some makeup, and I want to show you guys what I got. So I went to, there's like nothing on the Cape, if you guys have been there before. Um, I don't know, like we have like one mall, and it's not really that good. So me and Emma didn't know what to do today. So we went to Marshall's, and they had so much NARS makeup. And I was like, whoa. So I got a bunch of it. And can someone let me know why like the makeup ends up there? I learned about it one time in my marketing class and they just said like because it is um because like it's extra makeup that like they didn't sell or something. I don't know. But I got some makeup and this is what I got. So I got this blush. It's a dual intensity blush in the shade. I literally don't even know how to pronounce this. Let's see if it'll focus. Yep, there it is. So it's really, really pretty. It looks like this. Like, it's so shimmery. I just feel like it would be, like, the perfect shimmer for, like, a bronzy, sun-kissed look. So I picked this up. I really like NARS makeup. So then I got this other blush in the shade Unlawful. I'll show you guys what it looks like. On my hand I mean you can't really see it's like a shimmery can you see it on my finger not really it's like a shimmery um, pinky nude it's really pretty so I got that and then I also got this lipstick in the shade orgasm it's like a pinky shimmer. I'm excited to use that. And then last but not least, I got a foundation. I was so excited. This is the All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. And I got the shade Light 4. It matched my skin perfectly. And it was, yeah, the perfect match. But pretty self-explanatory just looks like that so I got that and then I also got this um, whitening toothpaste by the brand hello and Kenzie was using this in Miami she was using the charcoal one which I also got and I really liked it it really um, worked well on my teeth so I picked these up and that is what I got and I also got a notebook for my class so fun stuff but my apartment is like I have stuff everywhere so I'm gonna work on like cleaning everything up and putting it all away I also picked up these bagels from Rory's and I was really excited because they are gluten-free vegan everything bagels and I'm excited to have this with avocado kind of weird because I left Boston on Monday yesterday after my class and it's is now Tuesday night and I need to like go grocery shopping. I don't really have anything. The only stuff I have is right here. I have like lemons, banana, mango, ginger. So at least I'll be able to have something before my workout tomorrow morning. But I just looked in my fridge and I literally don't have anything. 
nothing i need to go grocery shopping and do that but i'm excited to be home i feel like being away on the cape it was so nice because it was just like relaxing and quiet i feel like i really needed that to get away from the city for a little while and experience that and just like be outside of and be like in nature <laughs> as crazy as that sounds sometimes it can be like easy to get caught up like when you're living in a city it's kind of hard to describe like there's no like trees up really anywhere and it's just like so loud all the time and there's people everywhere and you don't really have like time to like relax i feel like I always can be doing something when I'm here and it's really hard for me to relax like I don't ever sleep in I just usually like get up go to a workout like go 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 all day and I slept in today I got up did my thing and it was so nice and it really made me appreciate honestly made me appreciate the city so much more I was like driving back into the city just now and I was just like wow like I actually really miss this and I can't wait to wake up tomorrow and like go to a workout and like walk and get coffee this week and just um do all of the things that i do here and it made me like really appreciate like my life and where i'm at and just appreciate little things like that so just wanted to say that also i'm just feeling really like grateful for my life and every opportunity that i have and there's just some crazy things coming up and my memory card was full but what i was saying was that i just have so much coming up that i'm so excited about and i just feel so grateful to be where i am and to be able to do what i do and have such an amazing support system so i wouldn't be able to do anything that i do without you guys and truly i mean that so much and i am so grateful for you and thankful that i have such an amazing support system and you guys are so sweet and i just love like reading all the comments on my videos and connecting with you guys and just getting messages from you telling me how much i have like changed your life and ways that i've inspired you and it really like means so much to me that's what why i love doing what i do and yeah so i just want to say thank you and i just feel very grateful and i'm really happy about like everything in life right now i feel very content so yeah i'm gonna unpack my stuff now and clean up this mess but i just kind of wanted to come on and chat a little bit oh also um i got this new lip gloss sent to me and emma really likes it it's called lip addict and it's like a lip plumper it's minty and it's really really good so it doesn't like make your lips hurt like the Too Faced one does, but it's like minty and makes them feel like really cool. I used it the other day and I really liked it. So thought I would let you guys know. <laughs> it's by the brand Lip Addict. Hello everybody, it is the next day. I just wanted to end off this vlog. I just got to school, got a coffee, gonna go learn. But I was thinking about it on my way here. I didn't end off my vlog from yesterday, the Cape vlog. So I wanted to end it off here, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not. Also, you can follow me on Instagram. I always have it linked down below so you guys can stay up to date with everything that I'm doing. I post a lot on my Instagram, so make sure um, you're following me there. But I love you guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.